We're back again with a vintage legacy Modern Masters Ultimate Masters box topper edition cube draft. No, we're not. <laughs> we could be, you don't know. Where'd that little boy come from? <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy. All right, so it's actually Corset Cube Draft, in case you guys didn't know from the video title. We took Demonic Pack last time. It was very, very good for us. The actually, one where you lose the game? Yeah. We played Platinum Angel. Ooh. Okay. Ooh. And we also dispersed it. Dispersed it. Dispersed? Dispersed it. Before uh, before it went off. Also, this is one of the better... No, this is one of the worst chases. It's not a good one. Yes, this is a bad Jace. This Jace is actually terrible. I like Jace Unraveler of Secrets, the one from Innistrad. Which is like, basically plus one draw card, negative is return a guy. I do like Demonic Pact again. He's like the fixed Jason Mind Sculptor. It's, no, it's, well, it's, it's, it's fixed so much that it's actually broken again. And by and broken in a bad way, not a good way. I have no idea, this pack's really con conflicted. Um. We just did blue-black and we went 3-0, it felt pretty good. I'm gonna I'm gonna highlight this because maybe I don't know I don't know what to take, so I'm just gonna go with that. Whatever. We're just gonna draft the same deck twice. <laughs> Unfortunately there's not gonna be anything. Hajigulashi gifted a sub. Thank you so much, buddy. Really appreciate it. Kenubi, welcome. Jace is also a pack. His text reads lose the game. <laughs> Oh boy, yeah, it's it's the format of blue pact. I guess we could take strands of night. What about druid satchel? I I like druidic satchel a lot. I don't keep drafts often. How do you understand the rarities in each pack? Does demonic pack being mythic and sex? Uh, it doesn't matter. It's it just has no relevance whatsoever. Like, look, there's one, two, three, four, five. So there's five rares in this pack. It, the, the rarities actually don't have any meaning in cube. Welcome to Cube Draft, where the rares and the mythics don't matter. <laughs> where, where the rarities are made up and the rarities don't... I don't know what to take here. Strands of Night? Let's go with Strands of Night. We'll stay blue. Or black. Stay blue, black. What does that card even do? Two, two black, two life, and Saga Swamp, or return a creature from, from your graveyard to the battlefield. That's a lot of cost. Oh, I like Soren's Vengeance. I also like Phantasmal Image, but then we get to be blue, black again, and I feel like we just did that. Tavzone Image is the best probably card in the pack. What is? Image? Yeah. That was barely English what you said. Phantasmal Image is the best card in the pack. There you go. Was that better? I don't I think know. So. A lot of people don't know this is about a, a Dreadic Satchel, but you can actually put your weed in there. Hmm, good to know. Oh, 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 I really like Soren's Vengeance. I'll take it, boy. I also like Snapcaster Mage, snapping back Soren's Vengeance. Well, you have to get a Snapcaster, and that's not going to happen. He's right. Phantasm is just probably the best card. Oh, but then we get Garrick Wildspeaker? That's pretty good. Now I wish we took the Genesis Hydra, but this is also fine. Guys, you know what colors we are now? Bug. <clears throat> Look at all these four drops we have, though. 
Well, I don't think we're playing strands tonight. Why? It's a lot of cost, man. Two life and two black mana? And sacrifice a swamp. To return a grave titan to the battlefield? We ain't got no gosh. They, they don't go to the battlefield, right? They go to your hand. No, they go to the battlefield. Okay, that's a little better. Yes, it's just a literally reanimate. Uh, it's probably Doomblade here. Solid. Slawled. <laughs> Makes me like that because it sounded like slawled. Take the stupid Doomblade. Grandpa Goth. Oh, Sylvan Ranger too, though. I think Grandpa Goth's better. Oh, Sylvan Ranger too, though. Mm-hmm. Boo. Uh -huh. I've literally been watching on YouTube for thinking that this person was just in my head, but here, per but here in person, I've literally been watching. What, Bobby? What does that even mean? This is terrible English. I want to take the rampant growth. I do like Fauna Shaman though. It lets us discard things. He'll mm -hmm. come back. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I doubt it. I doubt it's going to be one of two cards in the pack. I think we're probably going to see Grenade and Buried Ruin. That's a fair assessment. Yeah, I, I don't think it's one of the two worst cards in the pack, for sure. Oh, Urborg seems great. So does Quicksilver Amulet. Oh, we can go Fauna Shaman and a Quicksilver Amulet? I like Urborg because it lets us sacrifice any land for Strands of Night, but also there is a Corrupt going around. I'm going to take the Urborg. Oh, Soren Markov and a Demon of Death's Gate? What is this? Nine mana. You're going to pay six and sack three creatures rather than pay its cost. Eh. I think I'd rather just have the Soren Markov. Soren boy. My So glad you didn't take Soren's Vegin because it's a combo with Soren. I don't know what you're saying right now. You bring out Soren, you take him to 10 life, then you Soren's Vegin him and kill him. Yes. Yes. That is also a combo. I feel like Corrupt should wield. It wield last time. Oh, Llanowar Wastes. Also, Phyrexian Plague Lord and Terror. This pack is gas. I feel like it's the wastes here. Did you trophy? I did trophy. I did. I did trophy. Can you even trophy, bro? Do you even trophy, bro? <clears throat> I think it's wastes here. Oh boy, there we go. Also, Druidic Satchel. Man, that card's value. I want to take the corrupt. I think it's just strong. I think Plague Lord's fine. I don't think it's anything super exciting. This is a Tarmogoyf. Well, it's definitely a Goyf. <clears throat> yeah, whatever. Careful with that knife. <laughs> yeah, I was thinking that same thing. I'm like, remember the... I think I said this in a previous video where I was like... Remember when I was playing with the knife? Look, hey, you is, called it. Well, nailed it. That's no knife. This is a knife. Remember that from uh, Crocodile Dundee? AustralianAdventures.exe AustralianAdventures.exe <laughs> It's an executable, you see. Oh, we've got a Solemn Simulacrum. Liliana. Rancor. My holiday turkey's always dry and my mashed potatoes are flat. What should I do? This is a good question. Put that shit in the crock pot. I don't know if that's a legitimate suggestion or not. I've never cooked a turkey. Brian yet. your turkey. Also, brine your butt. Everybody wins. I want to take Liliana. Ooh, Colonian Hydra enters the battlefield with four counters. Whenever it attacks, double the counters. <clears throat> okay, that's pretty good. Uh, Suck Slash Spider, also pretty good. Jade Mage, also pretty good. Leaf Gilder, also pretty good. I think it's Colonial Hydra. It's a good one. And hopefully any one of those come back. Man. We, I would like to take this because I just think it's good value, but I can't play it in a non-artifact deck, right. unfortunately. Right, yeah, yeah, that's the problem. 
Oh, probably still taking it. I think it's probably better than Husk. You think Bloom? I'm sorry, what? Bloom. Bloom. Bloom Wolf? This is whenever a forest is tapped, so I don't yeah. think it's that great. And I also, it's any forest, so if our opponents are also green, it's just helping them out. Uh, I don't want to zombify. We already have Strands of Night. I don't want to have that many reanimate cards. I also don't think it's it's that high of a pick. I'd rather just have Sky Scanner. I'd rather have Crappy Creature. Wow, Mutilate. This is put an artifact or creature from a graveyard on the, from a graveyard on the battlefield. That's actually yeah, pretty strong. It doesn't have to be yours. And you get to shuffle it in when it's gone. So that's actually pretty good. I'm probably taking that over Mutilate. Hell's Caretaker. Sacrifice a creature. Return a creature from the graveyard to the battlefield. Yep, that is another one. Uh, Why is that in here? Well, it's a Corset card. It's a little cutie. How are your teeth so white? Do you stand from coffee and wine? I don't, I don't drink either of those, but I don't know if my teeth are that white. I don't know if my teeth are that white. Um... Might just be plummet for the sideboard. Yeah, I like that. I don't care about flesh bag or black cat or health caretaker here. Actually, health caretaker seems pretty good. Let's take the health caretaker. We have so much reanimation yet, nothing to reanimate. I'll reanimate your mother. Hmm. Because she's dead. I'm gonna take Sign and Blood here. It's better than Seer, I guess. Fleshbag is decent removal. I mean, not being able to, to choose what you're killing with Fleshbag is pretty rough. I mean, if they have a 1 1 or reassembling skeleton or something, you're just like, oh, well, this is awkward. Oh, well, this is awkward. Oh, Mortivor. Power of a Siege Lord are creature cards in all graveyards. Awkward, am I? Power number of the creature cards in all graveyards. Okay, so these are basically the same card, except for this guy can be regenerated. It's got to be Necrotal, right? Oh, Charcoal Diamond, though. Oh, Prodigious Growth, though. I think we need some creatures here, boy. All right, we'll take Necrotal. Oh, Nantuko Shade. Shade, boy? Might have Oaks is real strong, though. Maybe we're just mono black. Certainly could be. We'll see. We'll see. Neck. That's good, John. Very good. I had a fun 03 deck. Well, as long as you had a good time with it. Wow. The blue is wide open. It's like blue card, blue card, blue card, black card, blue black, blue card, blue card. What's that uh, Plague Mayor do again? Uh... Opponents creatures get neg one neg one until end of turn. It's fine, and it can't be blocked by white creatures. Michael. Yes. Oh, Michael. Yes. Michael. I don't understand. You will. Blue getting ignored in a cube is crazy times. That is not normal. We're clearly in the darkest timeline. This is the TV I'm looking at. This is the TV that I'm looking at. I'm going to take this Macabre Waltz. That seems fine. And now there's a bunch of red and white cards. These packs have been weird. One pack with all all blue black cards. One pack with all red white cards. I heard that immigrant caravan can be blocked by white creatures. <laughs> I hope not. I'd rather have the the caravan than any of the people blocking the caravan. So. Blue being in order is the world I want. to... How dare you, Matthew? Or how dare you? Unless it's so you can get all the good blue cards. Oh, 
on black water, keep on rolling, Mississippi boom, won't you keep on shining on me? Look, the Zombify came back. Hooray. Like you can put that in your artifact deck. <laughs> That's true. Now it's actually an artifact deck. I don't know if we're in the right colors here, but the black is decent. Hey, Mike, just an FYI, I'm loving the haircut. God, why are you so awkward? Were you born this awkward? Or did you... It's a developed skill. It's a developed skill. You're an underdeveloped skill. We actually have the same number of good blue cards as we do green cards, so. Could go either way. He's like a young Neil Hamburger. You are. like You're like a young Neil Hamburger. I don't know who that is. I don't, I don't know if that's a real person or not. You don't know who Neil Hamburger is? Dummy. I actually don't know who Neil Hamburger is either, so. Liliana Vest, Primeval Titan. Okay, well, that's all I need to see. Dunzo and the Bunzo. I'm going to put this dude right into my deck. The Bunzo has been Dunzoed. The Bunzo has been assembled. We also have like three ways to get back a Primeval Titan. Just put that dude into play. Yep. Alright. Green solidified. He was the first person to walk on a hamburger. <laughs> oh, he's like a young Steve Meridian. Oh man, that's an old meme. Way to resurrect that one. Wow. That is a callback. Steve Meridian. God rest his soul, man. Yikes. Yikes. Nope. Lands you control tap, add one mana of any color. That's fine. Mitotic Slime is also pretty good. Actually, Mitotic Slime with all the ways we have to reanimate seems pretty busted, right? When it dies, you get two, two twos. Then they when they die, you get two one ones. And then you can just keep getting this. But you can just sacrifice this to, to Hell's Caretaker to bring back a different thing. Yeah, we're definitely taking this thing. Our deck is gas. Who's Totic Slime? My Totic Slime. Got him. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> huh. Well, I'll be. You did get him, I guess. Hey, man, let me see your Totic Slime. I don't, I don't know what that is. Let me see it. I can't show you what I don't know. Let me see it. I can't show you what I don't know you. I can't show you what I don't know you? Mm hmm. Okay. Can I see your Totic Slime, please? No. I don't even know what that is. Oh, Grave Pact. Ooh, that's pretty good. Grave Pact contract. Friction Arena? I think it's Grave Pact. Is it not Grave Pact? Whenever a creature you control dies, each other player sacrifices a creature. It's okay. We We're, don't have a lot of sacrifice things. Our guys, creatures die naturally, Michael. It's true. Oh, we're probably not playing Demonic Pact. That's a good point. Yeah, I'll take this pact. I'll replace one pact with another. One good pact deserves another. One good Michael deserves Michael's mother. Bicycle. One good Michael deserves a bicycle. <laughs> That's correct. Hey, man, what do you want to do for dinner later? It's a good question. I know. I wanted to involve the way we can play more. Shoot Rudy Tootie, shoot him, dude ems. We need more. We haven't even started yet. Right. 
All right, good point. I had not considered that. I'm going to take this hypnotic specter. Well, good for you, Jimmy. <laughs> Why? Well, good for you, little little Billy. It's great or good. Sucker screws your car and sequence the hands and discounting cards. I'm bam, sam, bam, 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 one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Four cards are coming back. I think Slime has a greater likelihood of tabling than this, and I also want another three drop. I don't even know if we're playing Plague Mare. What is that in the tune to? What? His song. Cotton Eye Joe. Michael B. Michael B. Michael B. Michael B. He'll be asleep for a day or two. Frank takes away. Mike doesn't know just what to do. Say. Anyway, I have no idea what just happened. Oh, it's take on me. Okay, <clears throat> Michael B. Michael B. So, Undergrowth Scavenger just has the Undergrowth ability, right? It enters the battlefield with the number of one one counters equal to the number of creature cards in all graveyards. Oh, it's all graveyards, I guess. I like Nighthawk here, he's a good boy. Mind Slicer, when it dies, each player discards their hand. Oh, fertile of ground. You wanted rampant growth, now you just get fertile of ground. Everybody wins. Ooh, court of calling. Is it only green creatures? No, it's any creature. Mm -hmm. uh, choose a creature type. I don't think we have enough creatures to make this relevant. No. Actually, this seems good. What Michael B. saying was take me home country roads, though. Uh, it's definitely not all of them, because that would be ridiculous. It's definitely... Oh, I like Xanthrid Necro Necromancer. That guy's great. I don't have any humans, though. What? Outside of himself. Yeah, well, he just makes a tutu. You sacrifice him, you get a tutu out of it. We don't have any humans whatsoever? I don't think so. We actually don't. That's weird. Doesn't matter. It's like Rot Long Randomator. You don't care about the ability, you just care about the actual... The fact that it, it's a 2-2 that you gotta kill twice. The actual factual? Yeah, brah. The actual McFactual. I don't know what... Wow, that's a surprise. What to say, I say it anyway. The days are not... I think my totic slime is it necrotol human? It is. Mike's a what a dummy. Wow. Well, you actually looked over the deck and didn't catch it, so I think you're a dummy as well. What a dummy. <laughs> I think yours was a little over the top. I think yours is always over the top. Got him. Got him. I'm always over the top of your mom. What does that mean? Got him. What does that mean? One day when you're old enough, I'll explain it. What does that mean? Look, he just keeps asking it. What do you mean? He just won't stop. He's a maniac. I don't, I don't follow. Can you explain? No. What do you mean? Hello? Are you there? Can, can you, anyone hear me? Can you explain? Hmm? What? I want to put this guy in instead of Zombify. A 1 3 flyer? Yeah, that makes them a discard, and whenever they discard, they lose a life. They lose two life. Hmm. And okay. we have not expect her. So we're playing the Spectre deck? Yeah, the two Spectre Spectre deck. <clears throat> Talking away. Michael B. I don't know what. Michael B. I'm Michael B. Away. I might just play 41 here. Sorry. 
So this is 10, 7. I like that. Oh, we get one more. That's cool. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah, all right. I'm good. Get her done. Sitting at my desk at work, like, man, I could go for some M&Ms, but dinner is at 6, then I realize I'm an effing adult and I went to get the oh, man, get those M&Ms. Good noise you got there. I know. Oh, what up, Quacker? Cosme, my bros may. I'll keep this hand. You like this hand? It's alright. Uh, do you think five colors is going to be reasonable? Maybe. I mean, it depends on if you get the cards for it. Am I right? Oh, it just got better. Do you agree? Do you concur? Um... A green would be nice. <laughs> there he goes. There he goes. He's dying. Killing this dude immediately. Magic, I see. Huh. Look, I gave them swamps. I don't think they care. Creatures can't attack. Oh, that's sad. Oh, this is all very sad. One green begets two green, if you know what I mean. If you know what I mean. It's a good jam. Wow. We're in the Mitotic Slime Mirror Match. <sighs> you gonna sort some plowshares, our guy? I'm just thinking about it. What? Thanks. Yep, that's pretty good. That is pretty good. Chad, might... thank you so much for the gifted sub. Really appreciate it, buddy. That might be our death. It's not good. Yeah, I don't think we can beat that. Oh. I can't do this. I forgot about the idiot. Yikes. Yeah, not sure how to beat that. Protects from all colors, huh? Well, that's pretty good. I'd laugh at you for playing Door to Nothingness, because you suck. Got him. You did got him. I know. Oh. Well then, six, seven, eight, nine. It's okay, we go to two, three. Going to three. One, two, three, four, five, six. We can deal five to something. I guess we can kill this. Gain five, six, seven. Go to ten. Boom, 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 boom. <clears throat> yeah, protection doesn't stop board wipes, but it's still pretty good. Oh, pro black. Oh, boy, this is going well. 
Grave Pact would be nice, but not here, I don't think, because we're a little too far behind. Yeah, Pro Colors means we're just dead to this next turn. Yeah, it's pretty hard to beat, actually. Yep. All <laughs> right, that's pretty ridiculous. Yeah, we don't really have anything to deal with that either, so I guess we just hope they don't get it. The classic sideboard technique. Just hope they don't have it. Alright, sand seems good. There's no way they can have it both, right? Have it both games? No? Huh? No, they're probably going to have it 100% of the time. That's how it works. So. Look at that little shithian. I guess we'll play Hypnotic Spectator first. Is this an artifact format? I don't think so. Whatever that means. Fashion will lead to the party, fertile and ground. They're stuck on one land, so never mind. JK. Yep, had a feeling they'd have a press of raise, because why wouldn't you? We can either play Fertile Ground or just play Fell Spectre. This seems better for the long term. This guy get hydro. This guy, yeah, this guy's trample. That's pretty good. Oh, no Kithian, huh? Okay, no blocks. I'll take two. Uh, we could just. Gain some life. Let's make them discard a card. Let's make them choose what card to discard first. I guess we could also just play Colonial Hydra here, which seems better, right? I don't know, man. Magic's He's hard. a big boy.
Wow, that's pretty good. Soldiers. Yikes. You doing okay? Yeah. Four, five, six, eight, nine, ten. Eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. We can actually put up a four here. And we get a Garrick and a Spectre out. So we'll make this guy. 4, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So we have to be able to block at least one of these guys. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Oh, should have played this guy first. All right. We can also keep this up and just block like one of these things. Yeah. Lifelink too. Yeah, all right, we'll do that. Uh, we don't have triple green, so we can't cord here. I mean, we could have kept this up and used it, but... Oh, we just won the game. All right. Hooray. Seems good. I kind of like Ranger's Guile here. Maybe over like Sign and Blood. They're pretty aggressive. Man, like we have a lot of good cards against them. Plague Mare. Necromancer is two for one. Necrotal's good. Grave Pact seems great. Like... If we can just get our thing on the ground, I think we're good. Thank you. I will keep Valley Man sixty two gifted subs. Not reasonable. Thank you so much, buddy. Really appreciate it. Come on, swamp into plague mare. All right, well, that's not it. Well, any land gets us Garrick, I guess. Oh, well. All right, now we're talking. If they play Mentor of the Meek, we're just going to kill it on the spot. Yep, and it's dead. Oh, no attack? Nice. Gasoline. Unfortunately, no black. We need a black source. But if we get one, huh? Huh? I mean, ideally, they'll just play two more one toughness creatures, and then we'll get the land, and then we'll gray mare. 
Huh? Maybe. <clears throat> yeah, that's not... That's not it. Okay. Well, that's a good start. Hmm. Hmm. Well. Well. Uh, it doesn't feel great playing with all the white borders, I'll be honest with you. You don't like their prettiness? <clears throat> I'm sorry, did you say their prettiness? Mm -hmm. No, no I do not. Mm. Oh, Banisher Priest, that's pretty good. I guess we'll take three, any land, and you get to just uh, start making angels, which is pretty scary. Man, whose dumb idea was it to do whiteboard cards? Your mom. Oh. Got her. <laughs> Jesus, I don't know how to beat this card. We're really like Necrotal here. All right, well, here we go. Hopefully they attack Garrick and don't draw sixth land. They drew a sixth land. Okay, so they get to kill Garrick and make an angel. Seems pretty unbeatable. Can you beacon the Banisher? I mean, if not, not when the Banisher is in their hand, no. So if we pass, they don't... If we do this, they're probably just going to pump. So I'm just going to pass here. I think this is... Losing the Plague Mare is better than opening ourselves up to a... Pump here where they gain 5 and we lose. They make a 4-4 four, four flyer. Especially when we know this is one of the cards in their hand. Necrotol one time. Come on. One, two, three, four. Come on, Daddy needs Necrotol. <clears throat> I'll also take a Court of Calling. Necrotal or Court of Calling. Did they just make this indestructible? That's kind of comical. One time, one time. A Swamp, yes. That's actually exactly what we needed. JK. It was not even close to what we needed. However... We can beacon to get back Plague Mare, I guess. <laughs> we can. It's not super exciting, but it does kill Kithian. <sighs> yeah, this is rough. Especially because now Court of Calling won't do it once Garrick is dead. I don't know why they didn't just make a guy last turn. I guess because they were afraid of a two mana removal spell. Uh, both of Garrick? Okay. There you go. You figured it out. <sighs> Card is pretty busted. Yeah, it's not bad. Yep. Yeah, we just can't win this game. Like, there's just no way to deal with four, five, six, seven in the air, and then they make another angel. So it's actually nine in the air. Yeah, nothing we're doing here. Well, that's unfortunate. Boop. 
boop. Yeah, the sand seems fine. You guys are going a little going a little crazy over here with the commands, so I'm gonna let you just do your thing. Boop, boop. Hey man, what was the food option? What were we saying? What was the... I could really go for some sunnies. I'm just going to keep going until you eventually cave. Yeah, well... Oh, a charcoal diamond. That's Sonny's. They're gonna make you feel good. You know, that's never happened. You've never felt good? Not afterwards, no. Dang. Going in, I was like, alright. But afterwards, I was like, man. That's a lot of food. Okay, please stop sending this as spam. Oh, discard a card. Let's discard a Swamp Aruski. Alright, so. Yeah. Don't don't think Necrotol is going to be doing us much good in this matchup, unfortunately. What's Sunny's? S-O-N-N-Y-S is our barbecue restaurant. At Blunnies, we're going to make you feel blue. Blunnies? Mm -hmm. I have no idea what that means. You'll figure it out one day. When? Ho one day. Why? Why not? Nothing you're saying has any connection to a conversation, just to be clear. Cool. At Blunnies, they're going to make you feel blue. Why? You'll see one day... Why, why not? Amazing. Just amazing. <laughs> you're like if you're like if AI actually was less coherent than it is now. You're like if AI devolved. That's that's how that's how conversations are with you sometimes. It's like reverse AI learning. Yeah, pretty much. Okay, good talk. Yeah, destroy an on black guy. Destroy an on black guy. This is great. This is going. It's. I mean, it's. I don't know. It's mean. Like I'm literally just asking questions and I can't get answers. I don't understand. I just want answers. You'll never get them. I know. <laughs> because I'm speaking in nonsense tales, boy. Nonsense tales. It's like Veggie Tales, but with nonsense instead. At Blunnies. Wow, really? Oh, it's random. Yep. Watch. It's going to hit the two cards that are not the black cards. Oh, that's a perfect two cards. 
Oh, that's great. She just hit the two cards. I don't even care about those cards. <laughs> I think we're playing the same deck. <laughs> Are you some kind of demented dolphin? Yes. Okay. Oh. Oh, doggies. Yeah, I want to kill that guy. One, two, three, four, six, seven. You got something to say? Talking to me? Yeah. No. How did I? Did I cast? Did I cast Sign of Blood? Yeah. Why? Okay. Well, I'm, I don't know. I'm not very smart, so what do I know? Look how much life I have now. Why doesn't Ghost Dad say Minate anymore? I don't know. We kind of just phase Minate out. It's an old meme. We say it from time to time. Minate. Oh, tendrils on the little leaf. The little, this, is a, this is a really grueling match. Well, that's pretty good. What is the lifespan of a meme? What is the lifespan of your mom? I don't know, like 80 to 100 years, hopefully. 100 years? Mm-hmm. Jesus. She'll be dead by then. She might be. Okay, I really don't know how to not have this go to spam every time. It's getting real annoying. Especially considering that's pretty important. All right, well, I guess I'm just going to have to... Do it later. Oh, look at this guy. Look at this stupid idiot. You might as well attack with the Fell Spectre. Phil Spectre. Yeah, this is the uh, this is the McGimp stream. This is my stream that McGimp is always in. You know. McGimp. That was cool. I was hoping I would draw more. My tenth land. This is an 8-8. Eight, eight. Next turn is going to be a 16-16. Sixteen, sixteen. Do you even know how big that is? Pretty big. It's a pretty, pretty, pretty big. Inspiration. Man, four gray merchants. Back to back to back to back. What did you say to me? A little Gary. Gary. Said inspiration. Like a little Gary McNeil? Oh, a grave. Mm, that's a good one. A grave tootle. Six and fifteen. Actually, they still don't have enough to kill us here, which is nice. So this guy's going to be a 16. So they actually have to block with the Grave Titan. And if we draw any removal spell, which we don't actually have in our deck, <laughs> then we can kill all the things. Yeah, man. Is that a little bristle? Yeah, it's a little bristle. You stupid mother trucking snicker. I think we're dead. Uh, the ranger enchant? <laughs> Uh, do you mean Ranger's Guile? I don't know what. Other things trample too? Jesus. Yeah, man. Oh, they have Strands of Night. They can actually just get their Grave Titan. No, oh, oh. they have to pay two life. They can't do that. Oh, you're right. Good call. I mean, we're still not doing great, but. We got a four. 
We have him draw. Step. I don't know if there's anything we can get back here that would actually help us. Reanimating their Grave Titan would be nice. We could draw a Beacon of Unrest, I guess. Yikes. That makes it harder to get. Okay. Well. Alright, well, let's try not to have Doomblade and Necrotol in our deck now, I guess. And Necrotol and the Doomy Blade. So long, little friends. <laughs> I'll miss you every day until the end. The end of what? The end of your mother. Oh. Well then. Until she's gone. And she'll be gone, alright. She plays Sculpting Steel. Why? And copy their Charcoal Diamond. Oh, their Charcoal Diamond, huh, Michael? Mm -hmm. Oh, their charcoal diamond. Tell me more about their charcoal diamond, Michael. Well, you see, it's a diamond. Okay, go on. It's made of charcoal. Oh, that's exciting. Keep going. It's black. It's not black. It's colorless, but I'll go on. No, I mean the, the, the diamond is. Oh, is it? That's yeah. amazing. Tell me more, Michael. That's really all there is to Oh, it. there's no more. <laughs> <sighs> does our deck suck? I think it does. I think it sucks. I think we have too many, like, tutus. Not enough threats. Tutus? Mm hmm. Tell me about your tutus. You just laugh at doo-doos? Yeah, I laughed at too many doo-doos. <laughs> oh, Lord. Never enough dooters. Look, we both have our two mana mana acceleration. Hmm. I guess we'll just play Hell's Caretaker. Because we have literally nothing else to do. Somehow my wife found out about the M&Ms. This adult is in Dan, you messed up, buddy. Your M&M days are numbered. Your my days are my numbered. Your my days are my numbered. <laughs> this card is just worse than, than a forest now. Unless you're casting Thought Knots here, but I don't think we're doing that. One, two, three, four, five. All right, well, nothing to really do here, unfortunately. Two six drops and a blank. My name is Michael, and I'm a big old turtle bird. Wow, that's cool. Take six, and then they'd make us discard our entire hand. Yeah, super cool. I'm having a good time.
this match is actually not going well. I yeah, think correct. we may have O2'd this draft. I don't think it's uh it's not looking good. It does not look too good, no. It actually you might even say it looks bad. You might. You might. Hey man, where do you want to eat for dinner? Billy's Big Boy Shrimp Town. <sighs> Billy's Big Boy Shrimp Town. You ain't never did to... You ain't never did to... I ain't never did to there. Well, that's good. Especially because it gets Vigilance and First Strike. Crying out loud. And like our one removal spell corrupt is in the graveyard. Boy, everything seems to just work out for this opponent. It is fantastic. Let's make a pact. A grave pact. It was a graveyard pact. He did the pact. What about chilies? Maybe, maybe let's get in the car and see where it takes us. Uh, hey man mm -hmm. you wanna go to the Chili's mm, kind of I actually don't hate the idea this is really weird oh we're at 5 good lord I thought we were much higher yikes it's gonna be yikes for me dog and of course if we block here they can literally just sacrifice Fester and Goblin and then kill our Hell's Caretaker. One, two, three, four, five. Of course, we're. Of course, we don't have enough mana for that. That's unfortunate. This is, yeah, that's pretty, pretty ridiculous. Thank you. Wow, this is like I feel like everything that could gone wrong has gone wrong in this matchup. It's actually ridiculous. Chili's doesn't have free chips and they used to. They used to have free chips well, and salsa. Well, technically, we can still get free chips and salsa. Through that reward thing. So, <laughs> ostracize. Literally, the one creature, they draw one card and it's a creature. I guess we could Hell's Caretaker it back, but, you know. I'm sure they're going to sacrifice this guy to kill this guy. So, I guess we can't do that. Chili Strips and Salsa, no, they're actually just fine. We have to block now as well, so. Wow, they had to have the sword. They had to have Festering Goblin. They had to have Ostracize. They had to have this guy and Mind Shatter. This is just like kind of a. Oh, this is where we get the uh, the chain restaurants are not that good spiel from everyone in the chat. Where they try to get on their high horses about. Chili's is totally fine. Oh my god, they targeted their own guy? Weird. That is weird. Wait, why would they do that? Oh, if they killed our care our caretaker, yeah, but they're we're gonna do that anyway. That's I mean that doesn't that seems like a terrible reason. Like now we just get a prime time out of it. Oh oh, let's not skip past our turn because I forgot that was during the upkeep. So now if they do kill prime time, we get a Liliana. Flipperino. So this flips. Seems good. Get a zombie. Uh, we can also make them discard a card, which is pretty good. Because we won't have any in hand. Actually, are we turning this game around? How dead are we right now? I don't know. I really just want to be able to plus Liliana, or minus Liliana for four and get back Hell's Caretaker, because that should put us in business. 
and we can pretty much play anything in our deck, so that's good. Um, all right, so let's play Plague Mare, I guess. Oh my God, how are we even alive here? So we have to dodge a flyer for like one turn. Uh, sword does give haste. That's rough. All right, so now we can neg four for caretaker or neg three for vampire nighthawk. Hmm. The problem mm. is Nighthawk is a pretty terrible blocker against Sword of Vengeance. You fall asleep? I ain't asleep, boy. I never know, man. I can't Sleep tell. with my eyes open? Yeah. What's that link? I don't know. No parking at the mall. It's a terrible place. What else? How about the zoo? Too much walking. Too much noise. You can't have any good conversation. Not like at Chili's. Where else? <laughs> Where else? <laughs> All right, well, that's pretty good. Oh, this is nice. This is unbelievable. They just, like... How did they even get this back? Oh, Beacon? Do they have their own Beacon? Yeah, of course they do. That's amazing. Well, that's the death of us. Cool. Oh, we could have blocked! Oh, we're so bad at this game! Wouldn't you have died? No, because the first... Yes, yes, we would have, because of the trample. Yeah, we would have died anyway. I thought the first strike would have actually killed this guy first before damage, and then this guy dies. But I'm like, well, no. if first strike is dealt here, never mind. Yeah, trample is bad beats. Um, yeah, that's cool. All right. Yeah, that was uh, that was something. All right, well, we are done here. We are dropping. Oh, actually, no, you get play points. You get play points. We'll finish it out. Hope you guys didn't leave. Finish it out in style. Man, I feel like we're actually coming back. That's the worst, man. I hate like when you feel like you're coming back and then you just don't. Eh, what can you do? Chad, have a good afternoon, buddy. Thank you so much for the gift subs. Really appreciate it. Have a good night, buddy. Have a wonderful time. Or have a terrible time. It's not, I'm not your dad. <laughs> Jesus. Mike seems like the grandma that's sleeping watching Price is Right, and when you change, change the channel, she smacks your hand and says, I'm watching that. You do seem like that. You're like the grandma equivalent of magic. You're the magic grandma. This hand is actually pretty decent. Yeah, all things considered. If Frank's not my dad, then I guess I'll never have a dad. Well, I'll be your dad. I'll come see you in December. How about that? You gotta adopt him. I'll adopt. I'll adopt Quacker. Take a look at uh, kind words. What happened? Where did I? What did I miss? First time tuning in, but I've seen just about every YouTube video for the past six months. That's pretty good. I appreciate that commitment. Glad to hear it, buddy. Glad to hear it. I will draw two. Oh, now we got a bunch of things. This is probably like the best hand we could possibly have, and I bet we're both. They're they're o one. So. Ooh, they didn't get anything. I would just waited. Yeah, I don't know why you want to wait a turn there. No, I don't want to wait a turn there. Just call me Junior. Why are you my... Do you have my... Are you going to share the same name? Fascinating. How to tell your dad from a Twitch streamer for kids. How to tell your dad from a... Oh, okay, I see. You're, you want to tell the difference. I get it. Oh, look at those little cuties. They have lifelink, right? Okay. I'm going to attack. They got float. We can't block them anyway. So is the blue the strongest? Oh, it feels pretty strong. I mean, let me put it this way. We went 3-0 in our first draft, and now we're like 0-2, so... You do the math. And both decks were black, so the only component there was blue. I don't know. It's hard to say. It's only our second draft, so. Uh, 
Oh, I love being able to just play a Plague Mare and get that Knight of Glory. Get that Knight of Glory. Being able to kill pro black guy for no real cost is pretty nice. I can also double block this guy, which I think we're gonna do. You know what to do. But do you know what to do? No. No, oh, that's too bad. I don't know anything. I no, I know. I'm aware. Since Mitch is the comic relief, why doesn't he start his own stream and get stupid rich? Because uh, he'd fall asleep halfway through. It's true. That's true. That's for true. Wow, they killed that guy instead of the Plague Mare? Fascinating. Fascinating. Nope. What is this you're doing? Alright. It doesn't even have any bat it doesn't even have any abilities. What does that even do? How much? It does not much. I guess we'll attack. Haji Gulashi, gifting the sub. Thank you so much, buddy. Really appreciate it. Has gifted 20 subs in this channel? That doesn't even seem real. That doesn't even seem real. Well, I don't want to play the Sky Scanner because then we don't get to draw a card. So I'm just going to actually gain 6,000 life. If we go pick up a TV, how can we get it back here? That's my question. Rent a truck. I mean, they could also just deliver it. Oh. How much does delivery cost? It's free from Best Buy. Oh. Get it Friday. Renting a truck sounds like a whole bunch of drama. That was more of a joke. I don't think it's actually a good idea. Really? Yeah. It's probably like 20 bucks. But why do that when it's free? Well, because I don't have to wait then. Dang, son. You on a mission. A 4K mission. Yeah, I'm trying to get a... I'm trying to look into getting a new 4K TV for Red Dead Redemption 2 before I start playing it. But... Oh. That's 4,000 Ks. It is a good amount of Ks. I'm just going to block here because it lets us sacrifice the Necromancer and then get it back. So, and we get the Sky Scanner back. They going to play tapped? Yeah, that's stupid. Uh, oh, wow. That's a good boy. Plague Mare's fine on this board, but I don't think we're in a position where we're going to be attacking for two every turn. So, I mean, if it could kill something, I'd be much more inclined. I'd rather just dig through my deck and find, like, Necrotals or... Strands of Night seems nice. Court of Calling. Okay. Yep, that's pretty okay. So. Oh, I'm not looking for a monitor, though. I'm looking for a TV. So. Uh, this is what I'm looking at right now. I'll just show you guys. I've had some... I've had pretty good luck with... Uh, with Vizios, so. Alright, so what do we have? 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. We have 11 mana here. <sighs> what can we get here? Can we, do we have, we have Primeval Titan, right? We can get a Primeval Titan. I don't know if that's great, though. 
I mean, it's a pretty good blocker. I like Necrotal here. Yeah, for 900 bucks for a 70 inch 4K, like, and it got great reviews too. Vizio's like really kind of, it's like misleadingly good. Well, it's just Sony's slightly less tier brand. Right, but like to the average person, it's like, it's, you're, you're probably not even going to really notice the difference, you know? Right. Like at the end of the day, it's still made by Sony, which is good. So, three, four, Sony makes good seven. TVs. I think we can actually just pass here. Doesn't your mom make really good TVs too? Yeah, she's yeah, that's her passion. <laughs> it's what she's most she's most excited about in the world. Necro tells humans you can chain with Necromancer to get more Zomboys. I was actually thinking we go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven for Necromancer, and then we can pump this guy up to a two, three, four, a six, five to block like a Johnny's Chosen. So, unless they do something ridiculous here. Primeval Bounty. Whenever you cast a creature spell, create a 3-3 three, three beast. What does this guy do? Create a 2-2 two, two white cat. Okay. That's fine. Oh, this is an enchantment enters the battlefield, so this is when you cast it. This is when it enters the battlefield. Alright. Yeah, this is all fine. This card's great, though. I'm a big fan of this card. Whenever you cast a non-creature spell, you put a three counters on target creature control. Whenever a lander is the battlefield, you gain three. And whenever you cast a creature spell, you get a 3-3. Three, three. Like... It's very, very it's good. really good. Yeah. yeah. It does a little bit of everything. All right, so you're not gonna like, you're not gonna attack. That's sad. Well, we might as well just do the thing. I'll just do it for a million. Don't get dazed, bro. You know what? I'll take my chances. What do we got? Um, actually, Colonial Hydra seems pretty scary here. If they have one card. Fell Spectre can get rid of it. I think we have to Necrotal though. Get rid of the Johnny's Chosen, right? Yeah, Necrotal seems right. Yeah, get rid of this guy. Oh, we can also sack the Necrotal and then Strands of Night to, like, bring it back. Yeah, Necrotal Loop seems pretty strong here. So we'll get Sky Scanner back. Just because I want to keep digging. Wow, this is, the, this is the deck in action here. Hey, Prime Boy. Oh, that's also good. Jeez. Put him to 10. And then we'll just keep hitting with Sky Scanner. All right, so I think we're getting strands, and then we're Necrotalling. So four, five, six. That leaves us with three mana, which doesn't do much. I do want to kind of get rid of this. Maybe. Maybe I don't care about this though. Maybe we'll just play Soren. What up, Zapdos? That's a Pokemon. Did you know that? Zapdos. If you see strands. Yeah, I'm just gonna pass here. Wow. If it's only 900 bucks, then you're probably getting the 60 hertz refresh rate. I would invest in 120 hertz. Yeah, but I think that's like a significantly. I mean, there's a significant difference between 120 hertz and and 60 hertz refresh rates on TVs. Oh, it also says 150, 120 effective refresh rate. Um, yeah, I don't know. It's probably still 60 with like some sort of software that enhances. It says refresh rate 120 hertz. That's interesting. Oh, greater good. Well, that's going to end well, I'm sure. Oh, God. This thing is huge now. Well, this guy's just going to keep on jumping in front of that bus. That's for sure. Being able to keep sacrificing... Get back to Necrotal. Sack a zombie. Q. 
Get out of here, little bug. Yeah, this is actually pretty bad with the greater good on board, though. Like, they sack it, they... They didn't. That's... Because they don't want... Oh, they have no card... Oh, yeah, the shame scoop. Yeah, okay. but they just... No, yeah, but they just draw seven and discard down to... Discard three, right? So they get to net four cards. He done messed up. Your instinct is ready. Crits a virtual in between frame one viewing at 60. We can't actually... Yeah, that's fine, though. I mean, like... I mean, for the cost difference, like, if you guys can show me a similarly costed 120 hertz panel that, like, actually looks good, I would, uh, I'd be quite surprised. Vizio and Sony have no relation? Oh, was Mike wrong? Let's just do that. Is video made by Sony? Uh, Vizio announced that Sony Corporation has become a licensee under Vizio's patent portfolio. Vizio, leader in American LCD HD market. Um, yeah, it's uh, this is Buried Ruin, not Mazevith. <laughs> so, I agree, Mazevith is quite the fine card. However, there is no such Mazevith here, my friend. Um, Coming in blood still seems good. It kills everything. Yeah, it's fine. Uh, I think of two uses investments too, but like, I mean, like, I, I can still get by three to four years. Like, my TV now is only three years old, I believe. It's not terrible, but you know, I mean, like, I could, I could easily keep it for another probably another three years if I wanted to you kept this I don't know why I kept it I was in the middle of the chat oh yeah this is pretty bad yeah surprisingly uh Mazebeth has never been in a core set so I mean if we draw Swamp Swamp the sand is actually great yes so let's do that mm, there's one that's close Brick Seek It I don't know what that even means god there's so many different like internet tricks that you like there's so many deal sites oh god god we're good at this game wow hmm. and the hand was epic he does have a pro black guy which is a little hard it's okay to we just with. have to we just have to draw our one vine mare did we go to 42 cards oh man we messed up i mean not really because we're still in oh that's cool why are you playing Temple Wait, Bell on your green white deck? Did they deck? mulligan? What did they mulligan to? Just six? Interesting. You did not play Temple Bell on a green white deck. What's wrong with you, boy? Or don't you? I can see a dance. They get. Oh, there was a fix. There was a. Was it Mythic Maze? No. Um, something like that. Yeah, it was something like that. Mystical Maze. Basically Maze of Ith Part 2. Your mother's a Maze of Ith Part 2. Yeah. And I'll thank you to not bring it up. Got her. <laughs> hey, where you want to go to eat, man? My mom's house. You want to eat at my mom's house? Mm -hmm. Okay. I have a product idea. Disposable glove made of paper towels for eating greasy food. What do you think? I love it. Okay, so we can't play this this turn. Let's give you a little boop. You're probably gonna, because you're probably gonna make us draw first, just so you can have the best choice. No. Okay. Oh, that's wow. wow that was a that great was a hit. hit. Holy jeez. Yeah. Holy snickle bottoms. Holy snickle bottoms. You heard it. I did. You heard it here first, bro.
Uh, it is a draw if you kill if you cast the card like Inferno and it kills both of you. Yes. This guy's dealt a lot of damage to us. Oh, a beast can block it. Oh, this is gas. Oh, that's a big. That's a beast. <clears throat> so many beasts. I got the beast in my sights. Three, four, five. This can also block it. <laughs> we can also keep up Grave Pact. One, two, three. No, we can't. We actually have a lot of options here, so as long as we survive, we are in good shape. Can we go one, two, three, four? One, two, three, four for Garrick. One, two, three, four, five. We can go Garrick into like Grave Pact. I think you just jam Primeval Titan here. Is that right? Would I recommend the Core Cube? Definitely. It's been fun so far. We've been having a good time. And I saw a Moz creeping in the stream for, for quite a bit. So that was cool. Your mom's dealt a lot of damage. Uncle Fish Jenna, what's going on, buddy? Mike's mom does deal a lot of damage. She's an aggressive woman. Thanks. Neon Tokyo! Welcome back, Neon Tokyo Rain. To foul with the resub. Thank you so much, guys. Really appreciate it. You guys are great. You guys are my favorite people that have existed on. I'm just going to get a forest because... Now all forests are swampos. All forests are swampos. Your mother's a sw your mother's a swampos. Lol, that's a guy. <laughs> you right. <laughs> you right. That is a gentleman. Oh, we got the primeval bounty. That is a good. That is a good hit. I like that. That hypnotic specter basically means only one of us draws a card with temple bell. Look yeah. at all my bodies. I got dual lands for days, bro. I would strongly suggest this TV over the Vizio friendly hundred dollars more. If you aren't going to get hundred twenty, you might as well get enough. But is that? Let's find out. Hmm. Ultra HD. Boom! 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 Are you attacking with this? With this kind, this poor unfortunate soul. Are you out of your mind? Are you out of your mind? I think we're just going to block here. Yeah, I think so. I mean, they got a 3-3. Three, three. I'd rather wait till we have Grave Pact. Maybe we just take 6 here. Oof. We don't have four. any reach, and we have Covenant of Blood in hand. Man, I'll take 6 here. I don't even care. We have so much life gain in our hand. What can they even do, man? How much mana do we have? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. And Garrick basically costs... So we'd, we'd go down to 8, so we can actually play... We can play a lot of things here. So we can go 1, 2... 3, 4... Garrukers. Actually, it's just strictly better to tap... Uh, swamps for this kind of stuff and then we can go grave pact two three four and then we have one two three four we have seven mana so we could covenant of blood something like this guy which or we actually should just doom blade i guess probably just gonna hit you for two here or not. Or maybe. Yeah, I think we do. I like being able to keep this... I mean, it's a, sor it's a sorcery, though, so it doesn't really get us anything. I just don't want to tap out to do it. My concern is this guy's making two dudes, but we're probably going to Doomblade this guy. <clears throat> yeah, we're 100% Doomblading that guy, actually. All right, let's see what we hit. Oof! My God, we're hitting all the good ones, dude. Oof, indeed. I'm going to pass, because you're clearly playing a bunch of enchantments, so I'll just wait. Wow. 
hit Spectre Ward and Prodigious Growth, both of which would have probably killed us. One, two, three, four, five, six. We can also just get... Oh, we can actually get uh, Necrotal here. That's probably going to get you a land, I imagine. Look at that little cutie. Alright, last card. Evolutionary Leap. Sacro is a creature. Reveal cards. Sure. Well, they don't have a green up, so we can let that resolve. Probably going to Doomblade this guy. It's the only card I'm real concerned with here. Because then they have one, two, one, two, three, four. If they have five attackers, we have two blockers. So at least three one ones would get through, and this guy would. Oh, yeah, this is just fine. Because this is what we actually want to happen, because we're going to be able to block. They're going to trade. You're going to have to sack a dude, but this will be on the stack. So uh, your trigger will go on the stack first, and then my trigger. So this will resolve before you're able to sack the beast. Liliana flips, which is nice. We can Covenant of Blood this guy before it gets any worse. Yeah, all of this is just fine. Oh, we're just going to draw that guy, I guess. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, so we can actually go black, black. One, two. Kill your blessed spirits. We do have to find a way to deal with this knight. But I guess we have beast tokens. Um, one, two, three, four, five, five. We have five mana. I got the beast in my sights. Uh, we can also just beacon of unrest. One other, we can just beacon arrest their thrag tusk. That's a good idea, I think. Thank you. I'm okay with that. Daniel, thank you so much for the resub, buddy. Twelve months. What a year. What a year. Really appreciate it, sir. And I don't really want to do anything here. I guess we could discard something, but that doesn't feel great. I don't think we really need Cordo Calling anymore. Maybe not. But we can use it here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, I'd rather just discard. We'll just discard Covenant of Blood. Um. We'll discard health caretaker. Uh, Cube so far has been pretty good. Pretty good. Oh, damn. Never caught the stream live before. Well, here you are. Welcome, welcome. Cube has been good. Uh, we're currently 0-2. It looks like we're going to be 1-2. But uh, last time I went 3-0, so that was nice. Hey, guys. Hope everyone else pre-ordered. 10 Ultimate Masters boxes. Looking forward to win the lottery this weekend to keep on living this millionaire life like a regular Magic player. I feel you. But you don't have to, like, you know, just, just don't, you just don't have to buy Ultimate Masters at $350. You don't have to do anything. You don't have to do anything except for pay taxes. You do have to do that. You do. Yes, I do. Picture page, picture page, picture page, picture page. Get your cranes and your cords of calling. So one, two, three. Add. Boop, boop, boop. We'll do it for three. Probably get a necromancer here. I'm from the UK and watch the British accent stuff on YouTube. I was crying. That's awesome. That is fantastic. Three cards under the real zone. You got a Hushwing Griff. That's actually pretty good. I guess we want just Nighthawk here. Um, yeah, Nighthawk seems good. Because we're going to ultimate Garrick here. Because we still get to keep Garrick. 
No, oh, it's really necromancer. I think that kills them. I feel like it might. Oh, we can, well, I also hope we can sign and blood their face. That's all I really want here. We can also soar and put their life to 10. Let's do that. This is everything I wanted to do in this cube, and we didn't get to do it. Everybody in yeah, the super red dead. zone. I can't imagine they're not. They got a fog. Got that Mesa Enchantress, though. All right. Negative 18. <laughs> 40 play points. That's better than nothing. Thank you guys so much for watching. Really appreciate it. Send those like and subscribe buttons. Check me out on YouTube, Twitch, Patreon, and meundies.com slash Frank Lepore if you guys are looking for super, super comfortable micromodal underwear or onesies or socks or Mike B's. You can mm -hmm. get 15% off on any of those. And it's free free shipping and free returns. So be sure to check that out. Thank you guys for watching. Really appreciate it. Send those like and subscribe buttons. I will see you guys next time.